We're very, very ready for this, for anything, whether it's going to be a uh, breakout of larger proportions or whether or not we're, uh, you know, we're at that very low level. President Trump putting Vice President Mike Pence in charge of the nation's response to the coronavirus. The president also says he's open to increased spending to prevent the virus from spreading. There are now 60 confirmed cases here in the U.S. And although none of those cases are here in Louisiana, the coronavirus is still having an effect. Take you well. The university enrolls international students and sends students abroad. Jordan Lippincott reports on how the international office is addressing the concerns. Her story new tonight at 10. Among the more than 700 international students at UL, some travel from China, where the coronavirus first spread. Wen Ting Wu came to the university about six months ago. My family members are still in, in China and they still at home now because the government believe that the situation is very serious. Wu says she feels safe in Lafayette, where university officials are taking precautions. We have been trying to, to follow the same campaign that we do with the flu, prevention. And prevention has to do with hygiene and how do you interact with other people and just to pay attention to how are you feeling. The university is currently preparing about 90 students for departure in May to Europe and Latin America. Their dilemma, the unknown. We have um, scheduled meetings with our um, safety director here on the campus. Um, and we are in communication right now with um, uh, the representatives, as Dr. Carranza stated, with the CDC uh, and the World Health Organization. They will uh, help us to know the coronavirus and how to prevent this uh, disease. In Lafayette, Jordan Lippincott, KTC TV3.